Imagine a world where a tiny spider could outsmart the biggest creatures. Welcome to the world of Anansi the Spider. Anansi, a symbol of skill and deceit, is a prominent figure in West African and Caribbean folklore. Known for his cunning and trickster nature, Anansi often finds himself in tricky situations but always manages to outwit his foes. His tales are a blend of morality and mischief, teaching us that brains often win over brawn. Now join us as we delve into the tales of Anansi the spider and the animals he tricked. One animal tricked by Anansi the spider was the mighty leopard. In this tale, Anansi found himself cornered by the leopard. But instead of succumbing to his fate, Anansi used his quick thinking. He persuaded the leopard that he could weave a web so strong that it could hold him. Intrigued, the leopard agreed. However, Anansi's web was a trap. Once the leopard was stuck, Anansi made his escape. So Anansi the spider used his wit to trick the leopard and escape his clutches. Another animal tricked by Anansi the spider was the hornet. In this delightful tale, Anansi fooled the hornet by offering her refuge from a rainstorm. Using a large leaf as an umbrella, Anansi convinced the hornet that it was raining, even though it wasn't. Once the hornet took shelter under the leaf, Anansi trapped her, effortlessly turning the tables. Thus, Anansi the spider tricked the hornet, proving that even the smallest creatures can outsmart the big ones. One more animal tricked by Anansi the spider was the enormous elephant. In a tale as old as time, Anansi with his quick wits convinced the elephant that he was stronger. Anansi proposed a tug of war, but instead tied the other end of the rope to a palm tree, fooling the elephant into believing he was losing to the spider's strength. It was a brilliant ruse that left the elephant humbled and bewildered. So Anansi the spider used his cleverness to trick the elephant, proving that brains often beat brawn. Yet another animal tricked by Anansi the spider was the sly python. In this tale, Anansi played on the python's vanity. He questioned if the python was truly the longest creature in the world. The python, eager to prove his length, stretched out next to a bamboo pole that Anansi claimed was the longest thing he knew. While the python was distracted with proving his length, Anansi tied him to the pole. Thus, Anansi the spider tricked the python, showing that ego can often lead to one's downfall. In the world of Anansi the spider, no animal is safe from his tricks. As we've seen, Anansi has bamboozled quite a few of his fellow creatures. Let's take a quick look back. First, there was the leopard, whose strength and speed were no match for Anansi's cleverness. Then there was the hornet, outsmarted by Anansi's crafty use of weather. The elephant too fell for Anansi's trick, proving that size isn't everything. And lastly, the python, who was wrapped around Anansi's little finger. Or should we say, spinneret. Each of these tales tells us something crucial. They remind us that wit often triumphs over brute strength, that even the mightiest can be outwitted, and that ego can sometimes be our downfall. So what's the takeaway from these Anansi tales? Remember, in the world of Anansi the spider, it's not always the biggest or strongest who wins, but the most cunning. So keep your wits about you, and you may just avoid being tricked by a tiny spider.